Welcome back to the Lockheed Martin Flight Services Pilot Portal Training Series. In the last video, we covered the brief buttons on the flight planning page and the briefing window. In this video, we'll take a look at the weather page. Like the textual briefing window, the weather page contains tabs to help organize all of the available graphics and animations. Many of the tabs have sections that can be twirled open to view the contents of that section. Each tab contains weather products that are specific to that region. Many tabs contain weather products that you won't find in the other tabs. The CONUS tab is where you will find most of the weather products for the continental U.S. There are two kinds of weather products available on this page, static and interactive. Static weather products do not change once they are displayed, for example, weather depiction or millibar charts. Typically, there will be a date timestamp indicating the valid time. It is very important to note the valid time to make sure it is current. Interactive weather products include radar and satellite products. You can pan around the view by using the directional arrows in the top left corner of the window. You can change the zoom level by clicking on the plus or minus. At the bottom of the window are the animation controls. You can play and pause the animations as well as step through the animations frame by frame. You can also change the playback speed of the animation by adjusting the slider. In addition to using the controls provided within the window, there are a couple of other ways to adjust the view. You can pan the view by simply holding down the left mouse button and dragging the mouse. You can zoom in on a region by holding down the control key and left mouse button. A dash box will be drawn as you move the mouse. When you release the left mouse button, the image will zoom in to the area within the dashed box. You can reset the image to its default display by reloading the window. On most computers, you can do this by pressing the F5 key when the window has focus. The Single Site Radar tab allows you to select individual radar sites. When you select a radar site from the list and click the Go button, you'll notice the same animation controls at the bottom of the window, as well as radio buttons that allow you to toggle between base reflectivity and echo tops for that site. However, there are no pan and zoom controls for the single site radar products. The weather page gives you access to a wide variety of weather products, some of which may be unfamiliar to you. Remember, you can always call Lockheed Martin Flight Services to talk to a trained weather briefer who can answer your questions or provide you with a complete weather briefing. In the next video, we will discuss the airports page.